Hello, my name is I King Skies. We're back with another video, and I just wanted to talk about the WandaVision streaming on Disney Plus. It just started literally today, and I just wanted to talk about what exactly and who exactly is controlling this alternate reality of this TV show. So, first of all, this is a show with WandaVision and starring in the MCU, and Wanda and Vision are basically your parody of a sick, uh, a comedy show in the 60s. I know it's not the six. I know it's not the 70s. It's probably like the late 60s. I'm not sure. Late 60s. I don't think it's 50s, but somewhere in that time frame. And it's like a, a comedy. So you have Wanda's the wife and Vision's the husband. And then they have like friends and then they have like the boss, you know. And the first, in, the first, the, <laughs> the one and two episodes, I'm keeping that in, and the, the one and two episodes are just them living their comedic life with a sprinkle of, damn, I wonder what's really going on here. That's exactly how the episodes went. So you have your typical problems like Wanda and um, Vision doing like their jobs and everything and they they look on the calendar and it's supposed to be a hard they don't know if there's a if there's an anniversary or anything and then when they do know uh they get it mixed up so wanda thinks it's the anniversary and vision thinks it's something else which leads to them doing some stupid and hilarious stuff so what happens is his boss comes over for dinner and all of a sudden you know, he, they start like trying to answer questions and WandaVision thought she was about to get her cheeks clapped and now she has to cook dinner. I'm sorry if I use that tone, I'm trying to be funny. Anyway, she used her, she, she has to cook dinner in the midst of not trying to get caught, of not being prepared. So you have these shenanigans and stuff like that. But at the end, you see him choking. And then the wife is just saying, stop it, which is crazy because not only was she not crying or it did look like she was trying to force a tear or something like that, but it looked like she couldn't cry because that's not what was in her line or something like that. But it looked like um, she was saying, stop it. But I think that was her line. But not only that, she looked directly at Wanda. She looked directly at Wanda and told her to stop it. Not only that, but in the second episode, you see Wanda, you see Wanda announce that she's pregnant to Vision, and then they go outside because they hear a loud boom. And then out of nowhere, these these I don't know, this dude in a suit comes out of the comes out of the ground and he's walking towards them. Wanda then says, no and rewinds it so i personally think from the evidence it's wanda doing this stuff it's wanda keeping herself in this alternate reality i do not think there is nobody doing this to her reason why is because it looks like everything she has done to this point is that she is controlling it there is no reason vision ain't that nigga dead anyway I think he is right. He he has to be dead. There's no way he didn't come back in the. Did he come back with the stone? No, there's no way. I I didn't see him in the end game. No 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 no. Yeah 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 yeah. He's dead. He's 100 dead. So the fact that Vision is even fucking alive at this point, or if this takes place before the Thanos snapping, I'm pretty sure that's not it. It has to take after, but. WandaVision is putting herself in this alternate reality because she wants to live this time period with him. This is something similar to Captain America, the, what he has done in the, well, at the end of Endgame. He went to the past to live his life out with his wife, <laughs> with his one, with his one. And WandaVision is Wanda's one. So they're in love and it doesn't, it makes perfect sense. Now, I also wanted to talk about um, if if WandaVision isn't going to put in this, doing this to herself, then there there are some signals that she isn't doing this to herself. 
like um when she was talking with the the rich lady whatever her name was the people came on the radio and was like wanda who's doing this to you but if they was if they was doing it to her then they would have <laughs> i mean nothing is happening so why would you interrupt that and take the chance of her snapping out of this reality if you didn't want her to be in it they're trying to get her out they're saying who's doing this to her it's wanda it's wanda doing all of this i promise you I promise you it's probably if this ends up being wrong hey i'm still gonna enjoy the episode so i don't give a damn but i personally think it's wanda doing all of this and hey my review on this uh on this show is is beautiful right now but the two episodes they did no no no. they're not gonna let me down but they didn't let me down but it's just i wasn't expecting to be patient i wasn't expecting to be patient on the first two episodes because mcu loves to get into everything right away you look at an end game you look at all the movies they get into the problem the solution right away and i wasn't expecting that with this with this at all i should have i should have because this is their first time coming back in like over a year i really should have but hey i'm enjoying myself right now and i hope you guys are too that is my personal theory i don't know what the title of this video is going to be about but i just wanted to talk about of wandavision and who's actually controlling this alternate reality that's what I, that, that's probably what I'm, what I'm gonna name the video anyway my name is i kings guys if you like the videos like and subscribe and thanks for watching it's criminal world order these niggas is pain i am the hero and i got them by chain show some on the ass like i'm the new king passing these missions like life is all easy to scream into the mic like my name is